In this video, we're going to be going through how to install BIP and the data editor plugin. The goal of this session is that by the end of the session, you will be able to have BIP installed and be able to have it actionable and also have the BIP Excel data editor plugin available inside Microsoft Excel. Okay, so there's a few software requirements. Firstly, you need to have a Windows 64-bit machine, which is running a minimum of Windows 7. You need to have Microsoft Excel installed if you want to use the Excel data editor, and that can be either a 32-bit or a 64-bit installation with a minimum of 2013. You also need to have a license key for VIP. If you head over to our website, you can sign up for a trial or you can email trials and curiosities.software. For further specifications and memory requirements, etc., head over to our knowledge base where you can take a look and read those. So the first step here is we're going to go through and install VIP. Okay, so there's two ways to get hold of VIP. We're currently on the curiositysoftware.ie website. Now, if you scroll down here, you'll be able to sign up for a free trial if you don't already have a subscription or license agreement. It's pretty simple to do. You just click through the link here and fill out the sign up form and then we'll be in touch with a link and a license key. Now, if you also go into the knowledge base of Curiosity Software here, what you'll see is that there's a whole world of written instructions for how to install VIP. Now, if we go through here and we click on the prerequisites and installation, what you will see is there's a download link hosted in here to install VIP. So we're just gonna click through here and download VIP and then once that's downloaded, we'll do the installation. Our download has complete here. So I'm just gonna click through and open up the installer. And the first thing we'll see here is the license agreement comes up. We're gonna go through and accept this. We can then um, choose the installation directory where we're gonna install VIP into. We can add a start menu folder and also a desktop shortcut. And we'll go through and we'll install this here and we'll see the installation is progressing. Now the installation is complete, we're just going to tick here to launch VIP. <clears throat> and what we'll see here is that VIP has been installed along with all of our extensions. Now we have VIP installed, we're going to go in and install our Excel data editor plugin. So I'm just going to open up a blank workbook here. So what I'm going to do is go to file, click on the options menu. And you'll see on the left hand side here, there's a little sub menu add-ins. Okay. Now down the bottom here, I'm going to click um, manage Excel add-ins and click go. Okay. Now what I need to do is hit browse and I'm going to navigate to where VIP was installed. So for me, that was in program files, curiosity, VIP, and then we'll see here, there's a bunch of Excel add-ins. Now, what I'm going to do here is click on the packed add-in here. Click OK. That I've already got this installed, so I'm just going to click Yes and override it. I'm going to click OK, and that's going to go away and update my Excel. So if I type in equals data now, you'll see it has all of the expressions. Just resolve them to make sure it's OK. I'm just going to close Excel and reopen it. And if I do it again, we'll see that it's still present inside here. Thanks for watching this video. Any questions or problems, email james.walker at curiosity.software.